starting. Okay. So for the wee holes, now technically they're supposed to be five in a row, but to start out with, for her to understand the idea, I just I want her to understand what Bob's clothes is for. So I'm gonna start with very few. That makes it easier for her to choose the right answer. Lily. So I'm gonna really go, I'm gonna do the same thing I did with the jump, where initially I'm just gonna kind of send her through. And this same one thing with this one, once she goes through, I don't want her to go back. So when she goes through, I want her to to come around to me. So Lily, weave, weave, yes. See, so my idea, my goal with this is I want her to understand when I say weave, I want her to go past the first post. Lily, weave, yes. And then same thing as with the jump, then I'm going to back up a little bit. Lily. Weave. Lily. Hey. Lily. Lily. No. Weave. Yes. Right? So I'm trying to reduce how much I'm moving because I want her to figure it out. Lily. Weave. Weave. Nope. Come on. No. No. Weave. No, 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 no. Weave. No, Lily, come here. Weave. Yes. Lily. Weave. Yes. So I'm trying to move for the back and I want her to still understand it. Lily. Weave. Weave. No, no. Weave. So I'm basically, I'm, I want her to, she's watching my hand for which direction to go, but I want to, so that's what it is right now. I am solely want her to learn the obstacle well enough that she starts to learn, she starts to learn that the words are associated with different obstacles and what she has to do. Lily, we've. Weave, weave, yes. Lily, come here. Lily, go, weave. Yeah, no. Come on. Lily, weave, weave, yes. And that is the weave pose. 